checking the list. I'm always aware of your current position. I just hold out to the perfect condition. Coming alive. Whoa. Alright, what's up guys? Welcome back to my YouTube channel. So today is the day that I'm going to go for my Ferro KG deadlift. Um, as you can see, I'm quite excited. Um, I'm quite nervous. Um, there's a lot of weight and I haven't done this in a while. So I haven't went for this, well, I haven't ever attempted to throw a KG on to, since like literally three years ago. So yeah, I'm feeling good. I've carb loaded a lot today, ate a lot of carbs. I literally came up from work and literally just had pasta and some pesto sauce. Um, a bit bland, but I had to get the carbs in, so there you go. Um, yeah, which is a bit peak actually because my camera broke, which is what I would have been using to film on. So I'm gonna film the majority of my footage on my phone, and also I've got one of my um, one of my boys is helping me film some um, content from my intro as well. So hopefully I'll be able to get some quality content of the lift for you guys. But yeah, if you're not already subscribed to the channel, guys, please hit the like. Um, please hit the subscribe button and also hit the like button and comment down below if you think I'm going to um, get this lift. So pause the video right now and go in the comment section and let me know um, if you think I'm going to hit this lift. And also let me know if you think I'm going to um, hit a sticking point. For those of you who don't know what a sticking point is, it's basically when you're lifting the weight and it pauses for like a decent amount of time and you have to like jerk it a little bit. and it's, or, or do you think I'm going to get it quite smooth? Um, where even if it is slow, it, it's just in one smooth motion. Let me know. But yeah, guys, without further ado, I'll meet you guys at the gym. All right, let's do a quick weight check before um, we get to the gym. See what I'm weighing at at the moment. I've probably had about it's four meals today, so let's have a look. It's like six o'clock, by the way. Okay, that's 92, 92 kg. So yeah, I'm, I'm pretty beefy at the moment. Um, yeah, hopefully every one of those kilos is gonna help me lift this up. Let's go, let's get it. So what, what am I gonna need to throw in a kg today, mate, man? Rip it out, bitch! Rip it out the floor! Go. I'm gonna stand up with it. Like I'm standing up from a sh after having a shit. Huh? I'm standing up from the bench. Is that, am I right? You know, you're gonna go through the 300. You know, like when you take one of them pills that, are, that you ingest, then you digest it and then go for a shit. You're gonna go, it's gonna go through you. Like you're gonna go through that 300 like that. That's a bit of a weird analogy, you know? <laughs> For a deadlift is I like to hang, just like a dead hang. It just helps decompress the spine and it's very good to loosen up your rotator cuff muscles as well in your shoulders. So this is really good to do before deadlifts or even anything like any pressure movement like military press, anything to do with the shoulders or the bench press. I'll just demonstrate. Nice and easy. Just let everything happen. Spinal decompression. I stay for like maybe, I don't know, like 20 seconds or so. Alright, so 
I've got 250 on the bar guys. Um, 220 went up pretty good. Um, so yeah. I'm feeling relatively good honestly, like um, I don't feel like I'm too fatigued, I've had a bit I've had some decent rest. I think right now I just think trying to calm myself down a bit and think about my form whilst I'm lifting is the main thing. But yeah, let's see how we get on. I will be able to tell what strength I've got in me after this lift, so let's, let's see what we got. session um, a bit disappointed guys I'm not gonna lie but um, it was very very close um, I'm just gonna run through a little bit about what happened so I pulled it it was quite fast off the floor like relatively fast but then as I got past my knees I hit a sticking point and I had to make a decision in my head either I try and yank it up with my traps and lock it out or lean backwards and try and pull it through that and then I, I picked the latter option and yeah like I lost my balance and ended up dropping the weight but it's giving me a bit of confidence because I know I've got the strength in me to do it. So I just need to build up a little bit more from now. Deload next week and then, yeah, I guarantee the next time I go for that, I'll be able to smash it without any problems. But anyway, if you guys enjoyed the video, please leave a like, comment and subscribe. And I'll meet you guys in the next video. Um, the next one will be Road to, Road to 300 episode 10. And I guarantee I'm going to get it by then. So yeah, stay tuned guys. Let's go!